Good afternoon. My name is Maciej Wroblewski. I'm greatly honored by the invitation to participate in the Queen Hedwig Scholarship Program to the USA. I'm very pleased to be able to stand before the Honorable Committee and introduce myself. Who am I? I am the third grade student of what is of the fourth high school in Warsaw, ranked the eighth in secondary school league in Poland. My school is known for preparing its students for further education worldwide. I extend maths, history, and social sciences. However, history is what I live and breathe. I am said to be open-minded, determined, hardworking, just like my hero, Martin Luther King, an idealist and non-violence follower. Now I will talk about my, my philosophy of life, love, brotherhood, and non-violence. I'll repeat after the famous Martin Luther King speech, Darkness cannot drive out darkness, only light can do that. Hate cannot drive out hate, only love can do that. So let's make the world a better place with acts of positivity and love. Nonviolence is the second key word that guides me through my life. We have seen that violence breeds violence. And the third crucial point in my life message, brotherhood. Just like my hero, Martin Luther King, I, have, I dream of a world where brotherhood and full right for everyone rule. Okay, uh, some words about my uh, academic development and achievements. I am person shaped by a passion for history. Since an early age, I, has been, I have been fascinated by uh, events of the past centuries, starting from ancient Rome to the modern times. However, the early modern period is the most absorbing for me. I definitely distinguish the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth Wars in the 17th century. I pride myself in my achievements in the field of history, biology and ecology. My first laureates I collected in the primary school, becoming a free-time scholarship holder of the president of Legionowo. My greatest success was the victory in national historic competition, Losy Żołnierza i Dzieje Oręża Polskiego, and curat historical curatorial competition. In high school, in turn, I managed to get the title of the finalist of historical Olympics. This is the award that I value the most because it was preceded, preceded by the three attempts to reach the final stage. The current school year is also associated with one, one more success. Namely, I become the finalist and the laureate. Uh, I become the laureate of a historical knowledge competition, occupying a high D14th position in Poland. It's time to talk about my social activities. Uh, my life motto is not to be indifferent to the surrounding world and try it to change it for the better. I have already mentioned uh, love and brotherhood today. Therefore, I will be happy to tell you about selected social campaigns in which I took an active part. To start with a school volunteering for Wielka Orkiestra Świątecznej Pomocy. Over the years, we have collected several hundred thousand zlotys in total. Furthermore, I co-organized two firsts for the benefit of Ukrainian population. The first one was dedicated to the children of Mariupol. The second fair was intended to raise funds uh, for, of, uh, for, uh, for inhabitants of Ukraine who had suffered during the war. With, with my class, we have also uh, shared suites with newcoming Ukrainian children at the East Railway Station in Warsaw. You may also be faced with me in my hometown, Legionowo, where I get involved in both large and slightly smaller matters. I work for animals, saving injured birds and taking care of abandoned dogs. Caring for the environment is also close to my heart. I clean the nearby forest, uh, collecting uh, bottles, cans, and other rubbish. It is impossible not to mention about our local action to help Ukrainians. I mean, sorting bedding and clothes, or unloading gifts, or frying 300 pancakes for Ukrainian children staying at the primary school in the Hoto in Hotomov. What would I gain from the scholarship? It goes without saying that this trip is a great opportunity to, for the development and experience that will that will strengthen my motivation 
to implement my scientific and professional plans in the future. I would like to study law, maybe American studies, and to work in diplomacy. Visiting uh, USA, would, uh, thanks to Queen Hedwig Scholarship, would allow me to visit uh, Stanford Law School and feel the atmosphere of such a reputable facility. I dream of uh, visiting the country where the uh, visiting the country where the most important legal document was created. I dream of uh, working on a crucial legal document in a line with American Constitution. As a historian, I would like to explore Polish connections to this document. The second benefit, an honor and an honor and privilege to meet and debate with most glowing minds, minds people with. Uh, ambition and uh, multi-talented focus on cooperation uh, in the various fields of science. I do not miss any opportunity to learn from them, I look at what connects us and share my motivation, experience and knowledge. Moreover, visiting such places as Silicon Valley, Facebook, Microsoft and many others is more than total immersion in American culture and technology. To sum up, bowing my head to the other title candidates, health to your attention as a promising research worker, maybe a constitutionalist lawyer, maybe a diplomat, a young man who wants to share a message about friendship, love, and brotherhood. A young man who dreams of a scholarship that will certainly give him swing. I will be delighted to join uh, the Silicon Valley group. I was born in August 2004 uh, during the Olympic Games in Athens. So I, would look, so I would like to point out as befits an Olympian, I would not give up without honorary fight. Thank you for your attention. Macieju, bardzo dziękujemy. Thank you very much for your presentation. And now it's time for questions. So uh, Mr. Rota. Uh, Maciek, thank you very much. And I have a question. Let's imagine that you have a magic stick and you can change something uh, since tomorrow. What would it be and why? I think that will be uh, Ukrainian-Russian war because uh, as you can, uh, I really, uh, uh, from the beginning of the war, I uh, tried to help Ukrainians and I think they deserve to go back to home and uh, be normal people like us. So I think the most important thing that I would like to do is uh, to stop the war. Mm -hmm, of course. Uh, Maciek, what have you learned about yourself uh, during this exercise, during the, the process of preparation? I think that I learned that uh, I can believe in myself. I can believe in my uh, st uh, strong, uh, strong sides. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, my stubbornness uh, for pursuing my, uh, my goals and my dreams. Super. Thank you, Maciek. That was great. Hello, my name is Michael Maciek. Now I'm working on a capital market, but in the secondary and elementary school, my favorite was the history. So I'm interested in history like you. Uh, but uh, my first question is, uh, which of the historical period of uh, time is the favorite for you? Which would you like the best? As I said earlier, uh, my most uh, uh, absorbing time for me is uh, the 17th century. Uh, namely the Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth Wars. So like uh, between Polish-Lithuanian Commonwealth uh, with Russia, with uh, uh, Ottoman Empire, with Sweden, it's really uh, hard times for Poland, but I think it's really interesting. Uh, but apart this period, I really like uh, medieval times. Uh, it is called uh, early uh, monarchy of Piast, uh, uh, f beginning from Mieszko the uh, first to Bolesław, uh, Bolesław the third. Yes, to the yeah. Uh, okay. Uh, no, like Shavuot. Yes. Like Shavuot. Okay. Yes. 
the first option. Okay, uh, the next question is because, you know, uh, after the university, now you're in the secondary school, but if you're graduated, for example, in the history, it's very difficult to, to find a good pay. Uh, and well-paid uh, job and uh, they do work but what would you like to do in the next 10 years what would you what kind of the work would you like to do uh, so i would like to uh, of course uh, go to uh, university of warsaw uh, to uh, study law as i said uh, and to uh, working company maybe uh, some american one <laughs> but uh, maybe i maybe it won't be uh, law but maybe i could become businessman so it depends uh, how my career uh, will develop okay i am the lawyer too after the passion of the history and i think that it's possible to work like a lawyer and like a business but my example is short <laughs> so I congratulate you the knowledge of the history and thank you for the presentation. Thanks much for your presentation once again. My question to you, uh, I already asked this, this one to, to a previous candidate, what is the most crazy thing you, you, you have made? Mm. Mm. I think that the most crazy uh, thing I made uh, when uh, in 2016 I went to Paris, uh, to France with my parents. Uh, I watched a uh, match uh, between Poland and Northern Ireland. I'm a huge uh, football fan. So this was uh, amazing uh, experience for me. Uh, and of course, Poland uh, won that match after Ar Ar Arkadiusz Milik goal. So I was really happy with my parents. And uh, for me, it was one of the uh, uh, outstanding uh, moments in my life. Yes, I think so. And what do you think about the last uh, game between Real and... and yes, Liverpool? and I'm also a Real Madrid fan, so for me, it was a huge victory. Uh, I spent time with my friends uh, on last Saturday, so uh, this was an amazing uh, moment. Uh, my friends uh, supported Liverpool, so uh, uh, this uh, victory uh, of Real Madrid... Uh, uh, mm, uh, was uh, more than just a normal victory, but because that my friends uh, supported Liverpool, it's really nice to me that uh, I was uh, I was uh, outnumbered, but I have won. <laughs> okay, fantastic. Um, thank you very much. Now it's time for feedback. So, uh, Mr. Rota, if, if, if you could uh, of uh, share your opinion. Uh, Maciej, thank you very much for your presentation and uh, I'm amazed by your sharing uh, on your philosophy of life. Actually, that was a very strong point of, of your presentation that you were open and, and, and it seems that you are a very reflective person and, and reflection nowadays, it's a, it's a huge value. And actually we seek for, for the time for reflection. So if you have this naturally, it may help you in, you know, succeeding many things and uh, uh, you are a very goal-oriented person, but at the same time reflective person, which is a good com a component of personality because it will help you to create something uh, amazing extra in your life. So I cross my fingers for you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, thank you very much too. I agree with Dorota and I wish you all the best for the future. And I hope that you are become a lawyer, good lawyer, and that you will be satisfied. Thank you very much. Thank you very much, sir. And two pieces of advice from me. Um, uh, I was a little bit missing you, meaning missing Maciej in, in your presentation. Uh, you were so focused on the structure. You were focused on, on the essence, what you wanted to tell, to, to tell us, that at least for me, I, I was missing you. Uh, Maciej came over afterwards when we started discussing about, let's say, football match. Then you started smile. You you, you put uh, some energy into in, into what you're saying. I, I miss that. So remember about the smile. And and this is very often that whenever we are stressed, 
we we are so focused not to make a mistake or to so focus on the on, on the essence that we are, we 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 are sometimes forgetting um, and this happens to all of us uh, even, even today even if we are after you know 20 years of experience in, in business or in meetings some sometimes we we forget about this so so please put enough balance of the essence structure structure was great you you were very focused but also it is going is, is going to be easier for you to convince the others if if you put uh, more smile more energy more passion and more you in, in in into it so this is point number one and a small technical one uh, these days more and more we will be having probably the the, the meetings the, the meetings online uh, so technical advice if you are at the front of the camera and, and you drink water Sometimes it's like this. And okay, sorry. If, if you, no, no, sorry. it's okay. It's okay. okay. It's just the feedback. And okay. if, especially if you have a microphone here, That's then uh, it, it might be, you know, the, the, the disturbing to 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 to, to your um, uh, to, to 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 someone who who listens to you in, in, and who talks to you. That's technical thing. Easy to to uh, to manage. In, easy, easy to remove. So that's all from me. Um, bardzo dziękujemy za, za, za Dziękuję bardzo. prezentację. Życzymy powodzenia i wyniki będą zostaną przesłane do Ciebie e, jutro. Dziękuję bardzo, do widzenia. Dziękujemy, do, do widzenia. widzenia. Maciek, powodzenia. Dziękuję bardzo, do widzenia. Powodzenia, wszystkiego dobrego. Dziękuję.